Hey everybody, welcome to my channel. My name is Lou Monastam. I'm a portrait photographer based out of both Orlando, Florida and New York City. And I've got a special video for you guys today, so stay tuned. Santa came earlier this year and dropped me off a present, and I'm really excited to unbox it with you guys today. Um, I've been wanting this lens since the day it released, and now I finally got my hands on it. And so I'm going to unbox it with you guys today, so stay tuned. Without further ado, let's get to it. All right, so we're doing our unboxing now. Um, I'm not cool yet, so I don't have a cool unboxing knife, so I apologize for that. So we'll just use the good old butter knife and let's get to it. Uh, I'm so excited, like you don't even know. Moment of truth. Oh yes. Oh yes. I'm so excited. Nikon 105mm f1.4. I am so excited to have this lens. Oh my gosh. Well, let's get it out the box and let's check it out. Hey right, guys, now that we finally got the packaging open, let's finally get the box open and see what's inside. I'm so excited about this. Now, I'm used to the gold ring around these boxes. I'm kind of sad it doesn't have that. It's not that big of a deal, but yeah. <laughs> so we got a box, which I'm assuming like the lens hood and stuff will be in. And here it is. Plastic, nothing else in there. We have the pouch, which is standard Nikon pouch. Uh, protect the lens pretty, pretty good from scratches and stuff, but not from like any actual damage. It's pretty flimsy, so that's that. Um, let's get this back in here. I don't really need this. We got our manual, because the warranty card, which I don't really know why you would need the manual for a lens, but we have it. And another change, I'm kind of used to like the little uh, plastic clam, the clear, I don't even know the word for it, but I'm used to that kind of being around the lenses. But uh, it's kind of just a little bubble wrap. And but oh my gosh, this lens is heavy. Wow. Wow, 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 wow. Oh my god, but this lens is amazing. Focusing ring is nice. Ooh, look at that front element. Oh good lord, I am in love. Look at this. Oh wow. That feels amazing. I can't wait to go out shooting with this thing. Let's look at it compared to the 7 or 200. It's already on the camera, but I mean, wow. It's pretty close in size. I mean, the 7200 is a little bit bigger, but definitely close in weight, too. That's for sure. 82 millimeter filter thread. It's pretty huge. Let's see with the lens hood. A, that's a hefty piece of glass right there. Wow. 
Um, I have the 85 1.4, but I actually decided to sell it and upgrade to this one. And I mean, 85 1.4 is a amazing lens, but I mean, I found myself sometimes getting a lot of chromatic aberration and just, I wasn't really all that happy about it. And, you know, so I just kind of wanted to just upgrade so I wouldn't have to, you know, deal with so much post-processing in my final images. And, oh my gosh, I do not regret it at all. This is a amazing lens. It feels nice. It's nice and big and heavy. Oh, I can't wait to get this on. I can't wait to get this on location. Uh, see how it looks on my DA10. Uh, using my DA50 to film, so sorry about that. Wow, that is a hefty piece of glass. Man. Let's see how it focuses. Focus is nice and fast, as expected. Um, I don't use the beep, so I'm sorry. I think that's pretty annoying on location when you you have the beep to check for focus. I, that's just really annoying. Today we unboxed the 105 millimeter 1.4. Uh, I've been really, really wanting this lens for quite some time, and now I have it. So, uh, you know, thanks for sharing this unboxing moment with me, you know? Um, if you guys want to see more videos like this, please like, comment, and subscribe to my channel. Uh, until the next time, my name is Lou Monestein. Bye-bye.